Hi folks, I'm Charles Baudet with Ozone Solutions and I am Eric. And here today we're going to demonstrate for you the wide variety of ozone cannons and generators that are available for both home and professional use. On the countertop today we have a variety of ozone cannons that I have bought uh, and or used at my business that have been uh, broken and or destroyed by my men. Um, most of these uh, machines on top of the counter here that you'll see have been rebuilt uh, several times by the manufacturer, uh, continue to break, and that's what caused us to go back to the old drawing board and redesign the ozone cannon uh, as it's known for the industry and to make uh, a better widget, in this case a better ozone cannon that can't be destroyed. So. Eric and I are going to get to work. We've got our uh, handy tools behind us. We're going to start taking these things apart. And when uh, we return, we'll show you what's on the inside. Because, folks, it's what's on the inside that makes all the difference. computer stuff to cool down your computer. How many yeah. CFMs do you think that's putting out? Not many, would you say? I wouldn't say very much. Maybe a tenth of a horsepower. You see this ozone cannon right here uses a tiny little computer fan. Uh, this fan costs probably around seven dollars folks and it definitely does not move enough air to make the ozone penetrate the entire room. Uh, that's one of the big problems we had and that's one of the things we worked on when we were designing the BioBlaster 3. And this particular fan wasn't even screwed in place. It was just wedged in tightly. And uh, I just pried it out with a screwdriver. Hi folks, I'm Charles Baudet here at ProZone Solutions and we're here to show you a little bit about what makes our competition so inferior to our products. What I have assembled here folks is the guts or the insides of four different companies ozone generators or ozone cannons. The one that Eric is standing in front of here is a $600 unit. This one is a $300 unit. This one I believe retails somewhere between for $500 and uh, this unit is a thousand uh, dollar unit. Uh, claims are over a hundred milligrams an hour for this one, 16,000 milligrams an hour for this one, 2,000 milligrams an hour for this one, and 6,000 milligrams an hour for this one. Although I don't think any of these things perform exactly as they're rated. And uh, what you see inside of these things is uh, pretty common and it's also mostly junk which is the reason why they had to, why they keep breaking for me and my men in the field and the reason why we went back to the old, old drawing board and created the indestructible ozone cannon. So the mechanism in the smallest machine here folks is a very tiny uh, coil with a spark gap and a transformer and it produces very low level ozone this machine retails for three hundred dollars this machine is uh... the best thing about it is it's apparently actually american made uh... It uses a chinese fan chinese transformer and a homemade uh, american uh, stack here but uh... again computer fan is not capable of generating enough volume of airflow uh, to be effective for high ozone shock therapy. Uh, this unit is one of the older ones. We didn't take it apart because it has a clear case, but obviously it has a cruddy computer fan. The case is all broken up. And uh, even the uh, ozone generating plates are made out of glass that's uh, been broken over the years. Uh, this unit is a fancier, sort of shaped like a cannon. 
and it's all put together. But again, what we have is a $7 computer thing, three transformers, and uh, six of their patented ozone generating plates. Uh, these things are supposed to be indestructible and good, however, this unit did not function and we started to uh, take it all apart. And uh, the company that sells this is one of the most popular ones on the internet. Uh, they claim to be an American company, yet uh, we discovered something kind of interesting. Uh, we took it apart and noticed uh, right here on the bottom there's some writing, and that is Chinese uh, characters. Then uh, we looked a little bit more closely, and on the back, we found a sticker and it reads, I'm sure you can't see this, but I'll read it for you. It says patented in the USA, but manufactured in Taiwan. So that's China, in case you folks didn't realize it. So there's over $2,000 worth of ozone machines sitting here on top of this table. None of them work. They've all been used and broken in the field under real life conditions. And that's why we designed the BioBlaster 3. So, if you have need to kill mold, bacteria, viruses, get rid of stinky odors in your home or for your business, or if you're a professional in the industry, there is no better machine than the indestructible BioBlaster from Prozone Solutions. That's our little video, folks. You can learn more information at ozoneblaster.com.